come back now to the last few questions. Um, what about what about God? Would you describe yourself as believing in God or not at the moment? Again, it's a complicated thing because you, I believe in the power of love and humanity and real things. If you're asking me, do I see the hand of God at work in the world? I'd have to say no, for the simple reason that if if God as a real thing exists, with all the things over the last decade that have been terrorism and wars are fought in his name or in its name, they've all got different names for their gods, but seemingly it's the same thing. But all the people that have died, the innocent people that have died, all around the world, terrorism, in the name of God, wouldn't you think now would be the right time for some kind of global sign? <clears throat> I live in the here and now, and I, and I go back to what I said at the beginning. I wish I believed in, in that, you know what I mean? And I know people that believe in it strongly, and I envy them, in a way. For a fellow who doesn't believe in God, however, I know. Said, said, I he, know. said he, carry, I do write about it a lot. <laughs> carry us all. Gas panic, the Hindu, little by little, dig out your soul. For no. a fellow who doesn't believe in God, you certainly carry on a fair bit of Well, it's a great imagery. I mean, God, you know, God... I wrote, there's a line in one of the songs off my latest record. And it's a song that I wrote about my wife. And it says, you're the only God I'll ever need. If I do believe in God, I believe it's here, somewhere, in everybody. And when I mention God and angels and all that seemingly biblical stuff in songs. My wife is an angel to me and a real one because she appeared out of the smoke in a nightclub when I was at my lowest and I've never looked back since then. And to me, she is an angel. But she's not a heavenly body, she's real, I can touch her, do you know what I mean? And I do regularly and it's great and uh, for me. Not for her. <laughs> and, uh, and God is in me, I think. And God is in her. And God certainly is in my children, you know. I believe in love more than anything else in the world. And if love is divine, great. But I believe that humans generate love, you know what I mean? The meaning of life for me is watching your kids grow up. And watching them go from... In loads of different stages, you know. And growing... With your wife is the meaning of life, I think, you know, and just the day to day, the trip of life. You know, some people live their life, they worry about the destination. Where is it going to be? What is, you know, they worry about where they're going. I enjoy the trip. You get where, where, wherever you're going is where you'll end up. Don't worry about that. Enjoy the scenery on the way. What do you think Jesus was? Well, I don't know. I don't know. Jesus, if it's to be believed, was maybe the first rock star. He had his band, 12 of them, and he had followers. And I guess he pre uh, uh, the, the words of Jesus if they are to be believed, really is just the preaching of right and wrong, you know, and all the things that you should feel if you're a civilised human being, do you know what I mean? But there's a lot of stuff in the Bible, and I was taught it at school, that is just, you know, it's all people flying out of clouds and stuff like that. No time for that. I don't see it, I'm afraid, I wish I, wish I did. Do you think there is something after you die? I don't know, I mean, evident... But do you think or hope or wish or...? It would be great to think that you would... that I would see my gran again somewhere. But, you know, I live now, in the here and now. I can't allow myself to believe that everything's going to be all right in the afterlife because it may and it might not be. I make it all right now, today and tomorrow. Not even yesterday, just today and tomorrow. Suppose, Noel, it is all true. Mm. 
When you get there to the pearly gates and he, stroke she, is standing in front of you, what will you say? So you've heard Donald back in anger, right? And they'd say, of course. And I'd say, well, look, it's me. Let us in. I can play a tune. <laughs> I robbed some stuff. I took a lot of drugs. But I'm all right. I can write a song. Let us in. <laughs> I can't play the harp, though. Well done. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well done.